we're in negotiations now uh, with uh, Representative Rossi and others, and uh, we're working our way through. You know, Senate Bill 261, which is my bill, um, creates two tier of victims, which isn't justice. Um, if you're a victim of a public school, you have to prove gross negligence, uh, which is almost impossible. Uh, which uh, isn't something I can be for as that bill's written. So uh, we need to look at how we're going to fix the bill. And it only has two of the grand jury recommendations in it, not all four. So Senate Bill 261, uh, I think a lot of people would be disappointed if that bill went to the governor. Thank I you. I have all the same goals in mind, um, and we're going to work through it. We're going to work through it these next couple of days, but I can't negotiate by myself. I need people to negotiate with me. Everyone over here cares very deeply about the issue. We're trying to find resolution that works for everybody. And, and believe it or not, there are lots of disagreements from lots of different people. We can certainly provide any guidance he needs and work with him on it, but these are the folks who have to draft the legislation. I've been clear, I want to make sure that whatever bill passes the Senate uh, has all four reforms that the grand jury uh, uh, recommended contained in it. I don't know how you could look these survivors in the eye and vote against them. And that's the clear choice right now. They can vote with the survivors and respect the work of the grand jurors, or they can line up with the lobbyists for the Catholic Church and the insurance industry, who are the only ones opposed to Down to voting with your conscience. I believe getting this vote to the floor, getting this bill to the floor, I don't think that there is a senator in his or her right mind that could vote against it. This is a priority, it is justice, and it restores lives and exposes predators and the institutions covering them up. The speeches are over, you know, the articles are written, uh, the House has voted, uh, now we're here to just take up space and, and let the Senate know that uh, the tax-paying citizens of Pennsylvania that paid for that investigation expect to see this Senate do its job and enact the recommendations.